Welcome to 4210 Wisteria Court. Come on inside and let's check this out. This particular property is located on a cul-de-sac and also on a dead-end street. Lots of opportunity. It's got amazing brick steps up to the entrance and look at this door of this covered entryway. Nice, bright, and spacious. It's got all sorts of different things to offer. The only step in this property is this entrance and then it goes into a solid surface porcelain tile. You've got two fireplaces, one is a gas log, and check out how dramatic these ceilings are. Multiple ceiling fans, often on dimmers. Also, you've got multiple window seats that are wonderful to curl up in. Recess lights provide accent. And check this out, you've got a secondary sink with a counter space for additional serving that opens up into the dining area. Now as we go into the kitchen, there's so much to see. Look at how abundant the drawers are. We've got solid surface counters, decorative backsplash. Also look at, you've got the glass doors for accents. I'm gonna show you some other treats in just a moment. It overlooks the dining area, and you also have a breakfast bar. Now, let's look and see what else it offers. Notice how all the drawers open, and you also have pullouts. You even have a built-in spice rack with adjustable shelves. Again, pullouts, and even in the pantry, you've got it set to where you have the ability to pull out the drawers, making easy access. This dining room, again, has high vaulted ceilings with accent windows, making it very bright and inviting. This is the second fireplace. It's wood burning and has a mantle. Again, it flows wonderfully. Now, let's check out some other special features. Here you have a furnace that's newer that has a filtration system in it. Direct access into a laundry room with a solo tube and so much storage. It goes directly into the garage, making it easy to come in and out. You've got a brand new water heater. Look at how much space is here and how much storage. Everything has a place. As I mentioned, it's directly off of the garage, so you go from the garage into the laundry, into the kitchen and family room. Now, let's go over to where the bedrooms are. Bedroom number one is abundant in size. It also has the solid surface flooring, a ceiling pan on remote, full wall of closets, expansive. Again, additional storage in the hall. We'll check out the bathroom in a moment. Let's go into bedroom number two. Again, this room is super large and full wall of closets. Raised panel doors. As we go into this refreshed bathroom, there's lots of drawers and doors and it's got a refreshed bathroom, shower, with an adjustable shower and subway tiles. Lots to offer. Now let's go into the master suite. This room is huge. It also has a ceiling fan, but it also has several treats. We've got two walk-in closets. Closet number one is walk-in and it has mirror closet doors. And then closet number two is actually just over here. It also has adjustable shelves and hanging rods so that you can actually hang a lot of different clothes. You have two sinks. There's one that's in one the room and then there's a secondary sink that's in this amazingly refreshed 
master ensuite bathroom. This shower is absolutely wonderful. It's abundant in space, has a sit down area, has built in shelves, dual shower heads, and it even has additional extra features we'll show you. Notice this door, guess what? It's gonna go into this bonus patio room. This patio room is almost 600 square feet and is not even included in the square footage of the home. It has skylights, it has windows that open, all have been rescreened, and it has the dual doors that go out into the actual backyard, and you can go directly back into the living space of the home. Dual doors open up, check out this beautiful patio area with pavers, and we even have a little area over here that's set aside to where you could actually have potentially a dog run that also exits out of the kitchen dining area. Now, check out this yard. OMG, it is huge. You're on a third of an acre. It's got a brick retaining wall, block wall. It's on an interior street, like we said, the dead ends. What could you do with this space? This third of an acre is ready for anything that you might imagine. Forty-two ten Wisteria, this amazing home located in the Orbit School District on a third of an acre, expansive, offering so much. Is it going to be yours? I'm called Krista, OIC Real Estate Services, here to see your real estate dreams come true. Is this it? Thank you.